Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about evaluating limits. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, the limit of x, or as <laughs> x approaches 0 from the right of f of x, where f of x is equal to the piecewise function of 1 when x is less than or equal to 0, and negative x squared plus 4x minus 3 when x is greater than 0. All right. Now one thing we want to note here with this limit, we're not really given a graph or anything like that, we're going to do it without it. We want to see when zero, or when x approaches 0 from the right. So if we're coming from the right, all the values leading up to it will be positive or greater than 0. Okay. So we're going to focus on this second equation right here. Now what do we know about the second equation? If we ignore the value here of x is greater than 0, it's a continuous function. right? It continues left and right, the, ring, uh, the domain is all real numbers without this restricted domain. So if we're approaching from the right, and we know it's essentially right uh, unrestricted domain, we actually can just plug in that value because it's continuous, right? So we can plug in when x is 0 here to find what this limit's going to be. So we take the negative, put a 0 in for x squared, plus 4 times 0 minus 3, and let's simplify this, right, or solve it, right, when f of 0, we'll solve it. Well, 0 squared is 0, don't need anything there. 4 times 0 is 0, and we have minus 3. Well, minus 3 is just left over. So what that tells us here that the limit as x approaches 0 from the right of f of x is equal to a negative 3, and that is our final answer. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.